Stop now. Tell me where it is. You and your brethren possess what is not rightfully yours. I, I don't know what you are talking about. Is it a secret you will die for? Please. As you wish. Wait! Oh, I won't hear about it anymore. It is a sacristy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The symbols are a language that can help us understand our past. As the saying goes, a picture says a thousand words, but which words? Interpret for me, please. This symbol, first thing that comes to mind, anybody. Hatred, racism. Ku Klux Klan. Yes, yes, interesting. But they would disagree with you in Spain. There they are robes worn by priests. Now, this symbol, anyone? Evil. La Fourche du Diable. In English, please. Devil's Pitchfork. Poor, poor Poseidon. That is his trident, a symbol of power to millions of the ancients. Now, this symbol. Madonna and child. Faith. Christianity. No. No, it's a pagan god Horus and his mother Isis centuries before the birth of Christ. Understanding our past determines actively our ability to understand the present. So, how do we sift truth from belief? How do we write our own histories, personally or culturally, and thereby define ourselves? How do we penetrate years, centuries of historical distortion to find original truth? Tonight, this will be our quest. My son is a student of yours at Harvard. Michael Culp. Oh, yeah. He adores you. He says you're the best teacher he's ever had. Ms. Culp, I think I already gave Michael an A minus. <laughs> he told me. Thank you. Mr. Magnus. Bonjour, Professor. I'm Lieutenant Collet from the CPJ, a kind of French uh, FBI. Will you take a look at this photo, please? My police chief, Captain Fash, had hoped, uh, considering your expertise and the markings on the body, you might assist us. Can you excuse me a moment? I was supposed to have drinks with him earlier this evening. Yes, we know. We found your name in his daily planner. He never showed. I waited for over an hour. Why would someone do this to him? Oh, you misunderstand, Professor. He was shot, yes. But what you see in the photograph, Monsieur Sonia did to himself. Rector, omnes quatuor sunt mortui. Sodales et ipse dominus manius. Ergo blocum coniuris divi. Eam omnes cad novimus, eh? Suis quisque oculis. Divabri priori ai finanzio, et secreta vincitum. Mors 
y un estímulos magnos. Este. Hic est parisi rector celator sorosa in aire supicis Then far, she's waiting for you. Okay. Mr. Langdon. Yes. I'm Captain Bezu Farsh. You like our pyramid? It's magnificent. The scar on the face of Ferris. After me, please. Ah. It's the pairing of those two pyramids. It's, it's unique. The two are geometric echoes. Fascinating. I'm not sure how much help I'm going to be here this evening. How well did you know the curator? Not very well. Frankly, I was surprised when he contacted me. Could we take the stairs? So, Sonia requested tonight's meeting. Yes. How did he call you? Email. He heard I was in Paris. Had something to discuss. What? You seem uncomfortable. 